ลู่อ่ะกูมาฟังสวีดังค่ะฉันเป็นโปรเฟชชั่นัลทูเตอร์และ this video clipping is all about the strategy case study August 2020 Sema the company is about run about and my video clipping today is based on some of the latest Sema articles which I saw in June 2020 And in April 2020, Financial Management Magazine, a lovely article written by some of the authors, and uh, taking cue from that one, I'm presenting this video for you all to understand about risk management process, particularly after COVID-19 scenario. Even if it is not, the risk management is a very very important function. We know there's a subject called P3 risk management, and we know companies cannot survive without having proper risk management. And today, post COVID-19, risk management is going to be much more important, I suppose, than any other uh, area of thinking that we should be looking at. Because as I've been always saying. Three things are so important: cash, cost, and customer. The three C's that will be the theme for most of the companies after post COVID-19 when we resume for business. Our industry, micro mobility, is very much vulnerable for this scenario. We are at a huge risk at this moment of time. Run about people may not want to use the hover boats, but on the other hand, with 50,000 employees in the company and with a 93 billion turnover, we cannot just let it go. So we need to be proactive and think of new risk management strategies. So this is what I'm working out. So once again, I invite you to look at this video. If you are happy, subscribe for it. And also, I'm offering tuition uh, online, at very very affordable rates. If any of you are interested, you could contact me on the WhatsApp number plus nine four double seven three two one nine eight seven or email learn with Kuma five digit five at gmail dot com. So. Risk management, we know, is always focused on anticipating what might not go to plan, and putting in place actions to reduce uncertainty to a to a tolerable level. This is the theory, but I think almost every company in the world failed to anticipate the COVID-19 situation, and I don't think there was any company that had a plan. Or uh, action plan to reduce that uncertainty, and we are facing that one. We are paying a price for that, and I suppose we'll be wiser after to, this scenario to be more proactive with risk management. So today, you being the senior finance manager of the company, all of us, whether it's the Run about or any company, we are focused to battle and survive the cash flow. Every company is thinking how to pay the salaries, how to pay the suppliers, and because the revenue almost will reach zero in the lockdown situation, so you will have a big, big task. So this presentation, I hope, will give you some insight into some of these areas for you to look at from a different approach. Because the way we approach to risk control, risk management, will decide whether we will survive or whether we will demise. So, what are your top tasks in risk management? Managing the cash flow, working capital, scenario planning. We had 30 million registered users. Now we may want to uh, do different kind of scenario planning. How many people will use? What happens? So there'll be many, many issues which you have to fight immediately. But of course, we should never, never 
miss our vision the future what we will have so should not give up should protect the future look at the opportunities what we have in the future create opportunities this is what you and i as senior finance manager in this company can do and also most of the people will be working from home we can't ask them to come till the matters are very safe but we need to ensure productivity of the staff so keep on talking to them and encouraging them motivating because we don't see them face to face unless otherwise we have a zoom meeting or a whatsapp meeting or a microsoft teams meeting we will not see them but very important that we get productivity while they work from home. so it's your opportunity to show your skills as a leader of empathy because there has to be a lot of empathy at this moment of time but you need to make tough decisions also so show your skills as a sima professional that you do have empathy but you are prepared to go for tough decisions the others in top position they should be made aware to look at risk awareness as an integral piece of operations i mean on a day to day basis speak about risk management how we serve staff what are they doing are they coming to work what is their health situation all that kind of thing i mean if you do this kind of thing where you take the lead we could insulate run about from devastating losses we live in a world that is changing so quickly and managing risk is more important now than in the pre covid 19 era risk management was all to do with uncertainty but we can see how quickly these uncertainties can come up there was absolutely no warning it came suddenly at least the credit crunch recession there was some kind of symptoms warnings but this came almost from nowhere and it has hit almost every economy end of 2019 beginning of 2020 so the most important thing is supply chain management customer relationship management so we have one source supplier we need to keep in regular contact with that party to know what is his position because everything will depend on whether he can supply because we are depending on a sole supplier for our boats we may be ready with cash and everything but what happens if they go out of business so you need to be very mindful of that part and also about other little little suppliers of whatever batteries or whatever we need to be helping them focusing on them too because finally we might win the cash battle but we may not have supplies because all the supplies would have disappeared so that can be a problem most of these hover boats are in real life it is supplied by china and some of the chinese supplies may disappear because there is sort of some kind of an antagonism happening so we need to be creative this is again you need to be proactive telling your management find new suppliers for hover boats and other accessories risk can be looked from two sides one as an opportunity positively and this is what we should try to look at in this covid-19 scenario or we can look at very negatively thinking that there is nothing going to happen nothing good is going to come out no think about the good things that is going to come out because we don't we may not need lot of office space we can get lot of people to work from our, from their homes we could cut down millions of rent that what we have been paying and digital applications so there are lot of positives we can take from this covid-19 scenario we you know so almost all the world's economies and the big economies have come to a halt so risk management sima probably identified it long time back and they put up a subject called risk management and we see how important and you and i who has learned petri will be in forefront in the risk management in the post covid 19 situation 
supply chain disruptions will be such that market will look very different post crisis some of the suppliers that who supply may not be there for us and they might be going to liquidity crisis financials so we need to be looking from a different angle we need to be thinking risk management on those areas too worker safety customer reputation we need to be looking the worker safety we need to be proactive all the time and see give telephone calls and find out how are they doing and you know they might get affected with covid-19 how what about their families so we need to accept this new reality and move away from thinking of past success sometimes we might hold on to some of those sentimentals sometimes some of our uh, emotional things we can't get rid of some of these staff because they have been there with us for so long and that you know we have personal attractions all that but we need to get to all that and to think of this new reality new style of management we should look for new opportunities that might arise in the crisis so as i've been telling last time also about maybe about giving this hover boats for our uh, operational staff in the government for them to make it for food delivery purposes and take advantage risk management is all about upside risk management too looking at for opportunities you be the finance manager there will be many many new projects coming up for evaluation we are generally supposed to be very conservative so we should never take that position where we say solid no because of the potential risk risks need to be taken risks need to be taken and risks need to be managed because by taking risk we get that competitive advantage and by taking risk we can get higher financial rate returns the short term you might feel it's a huge risk but if you don't do your competitor might do something different we have duck by a small competitor but who knows some fellow might take over that company some big company might take over and they could become a big time competitor we need to be mindful that we are the sole operator of hover boats we do not know for how long so we as finance people should not be a standard no but evaluate tough evaluations of every project should be done work closely with the project manager or the risk owner so that he identifies that you know that he has clearly identified the risk and then do a risk analysis try to understand the extent of the risk exposure so these are the the proactive things what we should be doing in this scenario post covid-19 but even otherwise look for new opportunity that might arise as i said and make sure to take advantage bring this risk management into our daily conversations it should be part of our blood circulation blood flow in the culture so that we know that we are will be practicing the best you know some of these employees we see even though we ask them to put their safety mask and all that they may not but if we keep on talking to them on a daily basis looking at your phone video finding out where they are what they are doing are they having the mask gloves etc that way you will build that risk management culture into the organization help management to understand that management managing risk is part of managing a successful business if ra run about wants to be successful you have to advise the management so that they will understand that risk management otherwise they will be looking in terms of you know how to raise revenue when on but it's your role here at the senior finance manager at the strategic level to keep on talking to them about risk management you should closely scrutinize how business operations approach areas of risk one of the risk will be health and safety people will not want to use the hover board so you have to 
do a close scrutiny even going to the extent of watching it by your own eyes or maybe through your phone video camera to see how they are doing that your risk management process should reflect the dynamic nature of the business it's changing every day and we saw overnight some sudden changes coming up capture emerging risk and reflect your knowledge in existing risk analysis so this is what is expected of you as the senior finance manager so basically the most effective way is to always to look at from the bottom line that's the way you can motivate the people at the top at the lower level show them what it is going to be meaning for the bottom line you might have to have meetings and report it not on a monthly basis now because the things are changing so rapidly today your people may be all right tomorrow you who knows hundred of your people may get affected by covid covid 19 so you need to have some weekly meetings even sometimes daily meetings to digital technology whatsapp microsoft teams whatever we need to be responsive and agile and we need to accept the lot of uncertainty life is never going to be same as what was before covid-19 now we do have 15 centers where we operate run about so there may be some kind of a decentralization happening so generally we have sort of standardized reports which they have to uh, send it but this is a moment where they at the decentralized levels they might have to take decisions whether to shut down if one person is affected one of employees are affected with covid-19 are we going to shut down so they have to be given that autonomy but we need to get reporting done and hold them responsible and accountable for their actions otherwise they will just shut down everything suspecting one person is having covid get those reports and pca reports and all that kind of thing reporting requirements we have our standard reports but we will need some additional ad hoc reports to meet emergency situation so your reporting structures need to get changed get top leaders to focus personally on worker safety issues rather than relying on reports maybe even visiting them and if you find that things are not good safe immediately take action to stop it one of your sima writers in i think in april 20 or 2020 or june 2020 she said she will visit personally to the sites to see what's happening around i mean this is not a time for us to just wait in our office buildings we need to move even if we can't physically move go to the digital technology through the video as senior finance manager we need to be more proactive providing frequent financial updates sometimes even twice a day you may have to send a cash flow rapid cash forecast and scenario planning tight cash liquidity working capital these are the skills that we will have to develop and the skills that we we have got we need to apply so my dear students If you are sitting for strategic case study August 2020, keep this in mind when you are writing your answer in the exam. And I'm sure the examiner will be very happy if you write these things rather than writing the standard textbook stuff. Customers communicate through technologies because they would prefer these apps kind of thing. You can have meetings on WhatsApp. We can have meetings on Microsoft. but app is a very very popular kind of a device which you can communicate and it's much more secure than even the gym uh, the email all staff meetings on regular basis to digital platforms so that the staff is kept informed that that you are kept informed by the staff the action and the local ground level and we can see the risk of corporate failures will be huge unless we are brave and resilient and we emerge as 
talk to us this is your task this is my task as sima senior finance managers managing this risk at this moment of time so once again i have deviated from the textbook stuff and given you some upfront of course i am acknowledging some uh, details which are taken from sima uh, finance management uh, articles in june 2020 in april 2020 and uh, the, the wonderful articles excellent articles i recommend you to read those articles get those things and this is what we should be looking at so thank you very much once again for viewing this video if you are happy subscribing and if you need tuition you can contact me on whatsapp plus 9477321938 or you can contact me on gmail learn with kuma 5 that is digit 5 at gmail.com i will soon have my website www.learnwithkumar.com I'm, I've been doing this tuition for a long time with INSEF and also I'm working with Ultimate Access and with Practice Test Academy also. So good luck for all of you all and God bless you all.